ball. Welcome back to the channel once again, ladies and gentlemen. How you doing? How's your day? I got somebody visiting. You want to see? You want to see. Oh! He says, yep, there's a kitty cat. Never mind. Screw you. I'm out. Okay. So, I got a couple packages. I opened them because I really wasn't sure what they were. Um, I've had this one for a while. This one just came in a couple days ago. So, new craft on the channel. Thanks to Creative Mayhem for challenging me to do this. Well, this, but then I didn't feel comfortable doing this one, so I went and bought this one to try to, you know, for beginner purposes. So, we are going to get into this one first, since I did get this one first. Um, I know there's a couple people out there that know what this is. It's nothing for you. Is there something in there? <laughs> no! It's mine! Shh. Crazy boy. Alright, going back up. It looks just like my booger butt. Yes. It's an empty bag, son. Jeez. Huh. They gave me another one. Okay. Um, two needles. Uh, thread. Them are some small beads, let me tell you what. Them are teeny tiny. Tiny guys. So, I bought a beaded cross stitch. I, I guess this is a beaded cross stitch. I really don't know. don't know because I don't see these colors here don't know that's kind of odd um, so this did come from Ukraine uh, they charged me $15 for shipping on top of the 35 for the beaded cross stitch um, and then they put a bunch of stamps on it okay it, it took about, I was right about three weeks from the time I bought it to the time it got to my house. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we have eight colors. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven,
it shows what they are, how many pieces, helps if I get in frame. So I've been wanting to cr try a beaded cross stitch and Creative Mayhem said something about it in a live stream. And I was like, I've already been looking at them. She's like, well, I challenge you to try one then. Okay. I don't back down from a challenge. I think you guys should know that by now. I, I don't back down. People think I may back down easy, but I don't. So, I seen this. Sister Cassie. Yeah, she's seen this and sent it to me and I go, yeah, I know it's in my shopping cart. I just don't have $45 or $50, whatever it was, to get it. And then, like a month later, I had the funds, so I went and bought it. And for my very first cross stitch, I did not want to screw it up spending that much money on it. And it's a... A replica of my dog. I mean, he has gold eyes. My dog has gold eyes. So, yeah, I I want to start it, but I'm so afraid. I don't even know. I know how to to hand sew, so I don't think it'll be that big of an issue. But I've never done one before, so. I don't know. So, I'm going to pause this, put this away, and bring you guys right back. Okay. So, like I said, I didn't want to ruin that one. So, I went on Amazon, and I was trying to find a small one. Just, just a small one. So, this is what I found. Look how cute that is. Oh my goodness. Squirrel! <laughs> oh, it's got tape on it. Oh. Oh, I got fingernails. There you go. Okay. Comes all nicely packaged. Look at that. That's presentation right there. got your number from 1 to 12. It's got your uh, string wound up. It's got two needles. Luckily I seen that before I pulled it out. Squall! And squall! <laughs> uh... Got a little card that says, how do you do? Thank you for purchasing the Beaded Creative from Border Kit. Yada, 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 yada. Um, now what I like about this kit is it actually gives you instructions. Um, now, oh, okay, there is English on here. The first one was this, and I was like, uh, okay, I can't read that, but there is English, and it shows you some stitches. I gotta learn how to do this, so luckily it is only a partial, it is only the nuts and the squirrel. <laughs> so, this also gave me this it is a printout of the stitches and where the colors go because they're not on this it just shows your stitch from corner to corners this actually shows symbols so that's a definite plus right there uh, and 12 colors for a little nut pile and a squirrel. 
so that was pretty good. Isn't he cute? Or maybe it's a she. I don't know. Look at them big up fish cheeks. To me, it looks like a fox squirrel because fox squirrels are reddish colored. We don't have them in my state. We only have gray squirrels and ground squirrels. And ground squirrels are evil, evil, evil critters. They live in the ground. They dig holes. They make big old holes in the dirt. Their horses or cows or goats or sheep or dog, anything like that can get severely hurt from them. I've, I had a horse that was crippled from it. Um, luckily, after letting him take a break for like six months, he actually, it healed itself to where he was rideable again. I just couldn't do a, a trot. I can trot, but I couldn't gallop or, uh, you know, ride hard, basically. I couldn't do any cutting. I couldn't do any steer wrestling, anything like that off of him. So... Very dangerous ground squirrels are. But I'm squirreling over here. I'm just squirrel. Alright. So I am the squirrel king from what people say. <laughs> Alright. So that's all I got for you guys today. How ironic is that? I got my dog and a squirrel. He is a squirrel loving, chasing dog. I'm just going to take a peek at the, the beads while we're here. Man, I don't even want to take them out because they have them so nicely done. But I'm just going to take that first couple of colors. I kind of like how some of them are like... See, this one's a clear bead, and then this one's not clear. It's like, it's different. So yeah, definitely got some, some more nice smaller beads. Showing the picture already. So that's it. I just had to see the beads. Put them back in here all nice and fancy like they was. Otherwise I'm going to be shooting myself later. I swear I don't have OCD but when it comes to certain things I have OCD. Anyways, I'm scrolling away over here. That's all that I have for you today. Um, I will link Creative Mayhem down below. Go check her out. She is awesome. I love, I love, I love Creative Mayhem. She's, she's a sweetheart. She goes live Friday mornings. It's like 7 o'clock my time, but I think she goes like 9 or 10 her time. Something like that. Check her out. She does videos. I love her. She's awesome. Sweet, sweet person. She calls me her a good egg. <laughs> I try to be a good egg. I'm just doing a moderator's job. That's all. Alright, everybody. I'm squirreling away over here. I'm blabbering on. I need to drink a sweet tea. So, uh... What was I going to say? Cheers to you, and peace. Treat each other how you want to be treated, and I hope you get the same respect back. Have a great day, y'all.